Not all anime shows have parts you can skip, but when it comes to fillers, everyone is making their best to stay away from it. I was surprised to find out that Bleach has a total of 366 episodes, and out of those, 163 episodes are fillers that aren't part of the main story. This means that about 45% of Bleach consists of fillers. By the way, in Bleach, Thousand Year Blood War, there are no fillers. Anyway, let's take a moment to decide if there are any good ones that are worth watching and give it a chance. Let's begin with the first two fillers on our list, Episode 33 and Episode 50. You can absolutely skip these ones. Next, from episode 64 to 108, all of these episodes known as the Bount Arc. I strongly recommend avoiding this arc because it doesn't add anything important to the main story. In fact, it might make the overall experience less enjoyable and more confusing rather than entertaining. Some folks found it enjoyable, but the majority didn't like it because they found it boring. The reason is that it introduced an unrelated new idea to Bleach. So, you can skip it after giving it a shot if you want. Now, let's talk about the next set of fillers, which span from episode 128 to 137. These episodes episodes are a bit more captivating compared to the other extra episodes in the series. They introduce unique villains and concepts that won't appear again. I'd say they're certainly worth watching, so consider giving them a chance. Moving on, there are three filler episodes from episode 147 to 149, and you can safely skip these ones. Next fillers from 168 to 189, the Kasumiyoji Conspiracy Arc is one of the less well-written filler arcs in Bleach. With 34 episodes, Episodes, it feels excessively lengthy and drawn out for a relatively straightforward filler story. So, it's best to skip all of these episodes. Jump to next fillers, from 204 to 205. There's no need to watch these two episodes, especially if you didn't enjoy or skip the previous filler arc because they sort of continue from it. So, you can safely skip them. Next fillers episodes are 213 and 214. If you're a big fan of Khan, you might consider giving these episodes a shot. However, I do recommend skipping them. The upcoming fillers from 228 to 266, this arc, known as the Zanpakutu, the alternate tale, is definitely worth watching. It's exciting to explore new aspects of the Bleach world. And what makes it even better is that these new elements have the approval and involvement of Tight Kubo himself. So, you'll get to experience new things that may not be fully canon but are close enough to enjoy. Next up is episode 287, and it's one of the worst types of filler episodes you can imagine, so it's best to avoid it. Following that, we have episodes 298 and 299. You can safely skip these two episodes. About the fillers from 303 to 305, they contain three completely unrelated stories, and you don't need to watch them. Next one, the Raigai arc that has fillers from episodes 311 to 341. It's actually quite good, especially for filler. In this arc, you'll get to see several fights that fans have always wanted to see. Everything is well executed, with great battles, an engaging story, and a solid villain. So, it's definitely worth watching. The last one is episode 355. Since it's the final filler episode in the series, it's a good idea to skip it and stick to the main, canonical Fullbringer arc instead. However, I suggest not skipping filler episodes altogether before at least giving them a try. You never know, you might end up enjoying some of them because everyone has different preferences. References. While many people recommend skipping certain fillers, others really enjoyed them. It all depends on your personal taste. But generally, the episodes I mentioned as worth watching are the ones you can try, and for the others, you can skip them without hesitation. That's about it for now. If you have anything to share or discuss, please feel free to use the comment section. If you like the content and value the effort I put into this channel, don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and support the channel. Thank you all, and I'll see you in the next video.